we're talking a really nice morning, but things will change later on in the day. Right, and the good news is even as we head into the afternoon, it's not heavy rain, it's not a ton of rain, probably a trace, less than a quarter of an inch for most of us, but there is a chance for some showers. But most of the day is dry. Yesterday, temperatures topped out in Milwaukee just at 64 degrees. We'll be warmer by about 10 degrees this afternoon. Spotty to isolated showers, mainly after 3 o'clock, the rain mainly staying light. A really slight chance for a rumble of thunder, but I think most of what we see is just some light showers. So it's one of those days where it's not a washout, but a good idea to keep the umbrella handy if you're going to be out and about this afternoon. Calm winds, it's mild, but clouds will increase as we head through this morning. Then there's a chance for rain, mainly in the afternoon. It's mainly staying light. Winds will be off of Lake Michigan, but as the clouds build in, I think everyone starts to see temperatures cool as we head through the afternoon. There's high pressure. It's staying well off to our south. That's going to allow those showers to move in. Notice off to our west, they don't look too impressive and they're not going to be all that impressive as we head into this afternoon. So mainly some late day rain before we get there. Temperatures likely to top out close to 74 degrees and then look at the heat 85 on Wednesday, 87 on Thursday. Thursday's the next day that I'm watching that could bring us a chance for showers and storms. Some could be on the strong side, but it all depends on timing. A little bit of a cool down closer to average Friday and Saturday, but for the heat and the humidity build around right back in. So absolutely feeling like summer as we head through much of the seven day forecast. Afternoon showers are possible today, but it's nice out there. We heat up tomorrow, Thursday, hot and humid. Right now it looks like we have two rounds of potential storms, one early in the day, and then maybe some in the afternoon, but that second round may stay down to our south. Here's future cast sunshine, clear skies out there to start the day today. By two, the clouds start to increase. Notice the rain to our west that'll move in and move out, but it's not all that impressive as it does move in. So that's why I do think some places likely stay dry, but we'll have some showers around as the cold front gets closer to us overnight tonight. We could have just a few more showers move through and then we dry out Wednesday evening. There's storms off to our west, but we're going to keep a really close eye on that cold front as it moves this way. That's what's going to bring us chances for showers and storms as we head through the first part of Thursday and then later in the day. The other big story other than storm chances today and Thursday, it's the heat. It's going to build in. It's going to be a warm one. Today we're starting sunny, but we have rain chances mainly after three o'clock. It's not going to be a huge deal, but definitely keep the rain gear handy. 80s back in the forecast Wednesday and Thursday. Storm chances on Thursday. A little bit of a cool down. We're closer to average Friday and Saturday. Then temperatures trying to make a run towards 90 Sunday and Monday. So certainly feeling like summer for most of that 70 yeah, forecast. Yeah, Sunday Father's Day, I believe, too. So if you have outdoor yes. plans, maybe start thinking ahead. Think, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Molly. <laughs>